Hi guys, today I wanted to show you my handbag collection. So let's get started. So first one I've got is a Radley bag, just a normal black crossbody bag. I tend to prefer crossbody bags usually. Um, so yeah, the black Radley bag. Um, you can see the little Radley dog logo just there. Um, it has a zip fastening in there like an inside zip pocket as well um also has like a zip secret pocket on the back of it which is really nice uh, then i've got this bag i believe this was from vera bradley in texas usa um now i'm very lucky you know that i have an older sister who lives in texas usa so i get a lot of things from there i'm very lucky to have had the opportunity to visit there a number of times and get to stay um for holidays uh, i don't like flying i really don't but i do it you know because my family's out there and you know if you want to see them you've got to do it so very lucky girl in that respect um so yeah she bought me this bag my sister from vera bradley absolutely amazing store in houston in texas fantastic um another bag like a crossbody bag again this one is a coach bag and i believe it's another one from houston texas that my sister bought me because coach is like a big thing over there i think bigger than over in this country and i went absolutely insane wore her down until she gave in and got me one so that's that bag again shoulder crossbody bag nice outside pocket um inside again an inside pocket really nice just for chucking on and going out in that's that one then i have this kind of crossbody i don't know like that's a tan i guess tan colored um little studded bag from debenhams over here i believe uh not debenhams dorothy perkins sorry on that one so dorothy perkins bag again just a press stud fastening and the insides um i believe this was dorothy perkins as well like a nice suede material uh asymmetric shaped bag just standard black a press stud fastening and you can see it's got this nice chain so you can wear it as a shoulder bag or like if you put that inside just wear it as a clutch bag with a lbd or a little black dress and some nice black heels for a nice evening out it's got a inside the bag it's got a little pocket just there you can put your phone in or your lipstick your makeup whatever you want to put in there so great for that let me fasten it up again that's it uh next like a rucksack kind of bag again like a unique kind of shape um i'm not sure where this is from actually i've had it for quite a few years so it's quite old again it's another one gifted from my sister so yep yeah, there's that like a pocket uh zip fastening that goes all the way around and then like a zip fastening there to put your knickknacks in and one on the inside again another rucksack kind of thing i believe my sister again bought me this from bhs um when it was open bhs of course in this country it's unfortunately you know closed down now so which is a shame uh then i've got this one I'm not sure again where I got this one from. Uh, this was gifted to me by my stepfather who has since passed away. Um, he passed away 2014, unfortunately, with pancreatic cancer. Um, but he did buy me this quite some years ago where he got it from. 
I don't know, but that was kind of a nice bag just to throw on when we went to visit my family in America, just for taking your bits and pieces on the plane, etc. So, yeah. Then this one in its little pouch is a Kate Spade bag. Um, again, I went absolutely mad to get one of these gifted from my sister yet again. So I'm a very lucky girl. Um, so on the case, the protective case outside, it says she tucked her coral lipstick away and floated back to the party. Kate Spade, New York. Can we see that? I don't know if we can see that. Can you see it? So, yeah, inside the dust bag is the lovely Kate Spades bag. Just the press stud fastening, the inside, um, and a strap. As you can see, I've not got round to using it yet. It's one of those things, just such a nice bag, and <laughs> I've just not used it. It's so nice, I'm a bit afraid to. I don't want to ruin it, but I will use it at some point, I promise. So that's that one. What's this one? I believe that this one, just a standard bag, was from uh, Dorothy Perkins or Debenhams, I can't remember. Um, but again, gifted by my dad. So, yep. And then I've got this one, which again, I should probably get rid of this to be honest. Just like I think I believe I bought it from Clark's shoe shop quite some time ago. Um, so yeah, just like a standard shoulder bag with like a plaited strap, good for throwing bits and pieces in. But that's probably gonna go in the bin actually because it's quite an old bag now. Um, again, this is the Vera Bradley shoulder bag um the rose pinwheel design i can't remember but from vera bradley again in the usa um my sister purchased this for me um from the vera bradley store in houston texas um again very lucky lady um because this at the time that of purchase this was one of the new designs that came in and i was the first person to buy this design the first person from Great Britain or England who bought this design, bought this bag, so very lucky. Um, and I also got the matching Vera Bradley purse to go with it, so thank you for that. And then, as the previous video that I showed you, just my standard everyday crossbody bag with all my bits in, um, I think this was from either Georgia Asda or Peacocks, I can't remember, but that's the main one that I use anyway. So yeah, that's my handbag collection. So if thank you for watching. If there's anything you would like to see me do a video on, please let me know again in the comments. Subscribe, like, follow me on Instagram, Twitter. I'll leave all the links and the good stuff somewhere below. So thanks again for watching. Bye bye.